It seems we successfully lured them this way. But those blank expressions. It's just like before. So is this Yui's doing as well? Uh, it's probably a caster's doing, if I had a bet. To think they'd use a spell to attack us again. Yui and the Shogunite must really not like us. Come on, Iori. Let's show them what we've got. So, showtime! All right, you revived. That's a problem. That's okay. I have a solution. No, I don't. I was getting hit. Ow. Well. There we go. All right. Big one out of the way. Missed a lot from Seven Eye Remnant. We're at Point Reach Tamo Preschool Edition. God, pl please tell me she's not actually Tamo. We were just having that discussion. Also, if she is, be careful with spoilers. I know nothing about the game. I didn't watch any of the trailers or anything. How far exactly are you in this game? Um, We've only been streaming for about an hour and a half. We're still in Chapter 1, technically. I spent an hour yesterday fighting the rogue berserker. That fight sucked. There we go. So I'd say probably not very far in, if I'm going to be honest. Oh, it's Samurai. Oh, Lord Samurai. A moment, if you please. I finally caught you, my dreamy Lord Summer. Oh, no. Oh, God, no. Um, how should I call you? I am Mi Mi Miyamoto Iori. No, that's not what I wanted to say. She looks like a duck, quacks like a duck, waddle like a duck. What am I supposed to think? Look, I'm having hope that she's not one of the Tamo Nine. I'm hoping that she just is some other fox creature. <laughs> Lord Iori, I shall never forget. I am Ryder, a rogue servant linked to Uino. <laughs> Abandon all hope, ye winter here. He's running on copium. Look, I'm not saying I'm snorting that good shit, but... <sighs> oh, God. That actually hurt to do. That actually hurt a lot. <laughs> oh, now my nose hurts. Hey, what can I say? I'm a method actor, you know? I actually got some real cocaine to make it sound like I'm snorting cocaine. Um, isn't that illegal? Nah, nah, see, I told them it's for an acting gig. They totally understood. But Ryder is such a dull name. So... Do please call. Oh God! Moment of truth, everyone. So do please call me by my real name. What are you chattering about, Iori? More are coming. Oh my! 
How rude of them to interrupt our precious liaison. Such barbaric visitors. Please, Ori Yori, make use of my power. Okay. This is... Wait, is she in the background? That's actually cool. She's actually in the back. That's, that's actually cool. I like that. We're actually going to deal with these things really quick. Like, oh, that was the wrong skill. Yatta. This isn't good. There is residual magic energy, but the spellcaster in question has left hardly any trail. I'm to assassinate the president for a gig. I'm holding him hostage at gunpoint for giggles. <laughs> so there's no way to find out who was controlling them. We do know that it's an experienced spellcaster. Who knows how to cover their tracks, but... We don't know if they're consorting with you or the Shogunite. How irritating. Our plan to provoke, our plan to provoke them has failed. Whatever the case, we should rethink our next move. Also, your help is greatly appreciated. Thank you, Ryder. No need to thank me. I fought for my own reasons. Much like another great warrior, I too fight for my friends. And please don't call me Ryder, Liori, Lord Iori. It is such an ugly name. I am called God damn it! <sighs> I'm gonna find Nasu and I'm gonna tear off his fucking Okay, I gotta look this up. Hold on. I want to see how match her person how far her personality actually matches from the original description, just out of pure curiosity. Uh, uh, nine. There you go, Tamamo Nine. Uh, let's see. Oh, there we go. <laughs> wow. Okay. I mean, it matches. Tamamo Aria. Yellow. Note. The strange one. Okay. <laughs> uh, but please do call me Aria. Rogue Writer. And I have eventually to choose when and how their personality it will be. I mean, to be fair, most of their personalities are kind of already semi-outlined. Personally, I'm still waiting for Tamoguchi to get added. Yes, that is actually really one of them. Uh, want each of the Tama 9 to show up in different fate works. I don't know about that one. I can neither confirm nor deny that. Tama that has the swag. <laughs> Actually, according to Tamoguchi's description, likes expensive things. First mentioned during Tamo's ending in Fate Extra Triple C. The other ones have like great notes too. We have Tamo Delmo, the supremacy of the home. Is the only note given. Tamo no Hime, the non-committal princess. Some of these sound really good. I'm just afraid of what not what Nasu's gonna do to them. 
She seems to have taken quite a liking to you, Iyori. What did you do? Cast an enthralling spell on her during the fight? Are you able to change Iyori's outfit? As far as I know, no, but I'm also still very early into this. I'll say this much, um, when you equip different equipments on his swords, that actually changes how his swords look. <laughs> Such a bad boy. I have some questions about her taste though. Yeah, the, uh, the blade drip is basically like your equipment. Like, it'll adjust how stuff do, like, do better at a certain stance, gain health for killing enemies, etc., etc., and also affects your stats. Enough, you two. My taste? I love beautiful things, shiny gems, and portraits painted with passion. <laughs> the sea at sunset Affectionate lovers The sky today I want to have them all Hi Feather I gotta say though As far as the Tamos are concerned I dislike Arya the least So far Which is why I also want this. Your virginity. What? Oh God, I was joking! <laughs> My prediction powers are terrible. <sighs> I want you, Lord Iori. Oh. Pardon? <laughs> uh, sorry, but I don't know what you're talking about. If you want something beautiful, it would be Saber's skill with the sword, not me. Besides, a woman couldn't rely on me. I'm not even fit to serve a lord. I see. That is a disappointment. But I would never compel you to be with me. Unlike some. Then, would you be my friend instead? Okay, I'm starting to like her now. A friend? That shouldn't be a problem, I think. Okay. I have a weird feeling about this, but... <laughs> My god, she understands consent? <laughs> it's probably not a bad idea to become friends with a rogue heroic spirit. Congrats, you gained a friend! Yay! Really? I'm so glad. Let's do lots of fun things together. And learn all about each other, Lord Iori. <laughs> Such romantic talk. I wonder what kind of face Kaya would make if she heard this. And this is your problem, too. So, um, how should I put this? I might need your help at times. I'd really appreciate it if you would help me, Ryder. Oh, Lord Iori, you mean Arya? Do you remember to call me that next time? You're a lucky guy, Yori. We didn't get any clues but you about Yui, but... You should be glad you made friends with a rogue servant. This is some serious luck. How's the game compared to the other recent Fate games? Um... I went into it expecting something like Extella, like a typical Dynasty Warriors. The closest I can put it to is... Imagine if Dynasty Warriors and a faster paced version of something like Dark Souls, note, something like it, not exactly like it, something like it, had a baby. There is still fast hack and slash pace to it, but you are definitely encouraged, especially against servant fights, 
to battle to battle strategically wait for openings wait for their guard to get lowered deal attacks like that and also you actually play the majority as the master basically if shiro basically got his own wish fulfillment from fate route but you do have chances to swap over to your servant to play as them they are incredibly powerful and you can also call on them mid battle to perform their uh specials to weaken enemies the Dark Souls of Fate. I was avoiding that. <laughs> yeah. I was avoiding actually comparing it to Dark Souls, but I can't think of any other game where you tactically wait, dodge opponents, counter them, and, like, wait for openings to attack people and do stuff like that. So it's far more tactical than it appears. I'm not sure about how late game he is compared, but... I did try to take on a Berserker, and he basically crushed my fucking face in. So I had to actually think strategically with him and fight him that way. Fighting a Servant is actually treated like a big deal. <laughs> right, let's leave it at that. Should we head to the Samurai Residence in uh, Sudobashi next? This magical energy is like nothing I've seen before. Much like Asakusa and Yoshiwara, the spirit font in, font in Uno is brimming with magical energy. With this much power, taking over minor spirit fonts will proceed apace. Bear fonts key location, certain energy flow. Got it. Pay game that requires one IQ instead of zero. It also requires you're actually good at timing. That's my problem. I'm very bad at trying to dodge uh, dodge attacks. We've got plenty of magical energy. This should be easy pickings. Wait, look there. The flow of the ley line connected to the minor spirit font. The energy currently connects all the way to Sudobashi. Artoria show up. I actually don't know who's in the game. Uh, cause I avoided all of the, uh, I avoided all the trailers, everything else. I only know th three, yeah, three servants aside from the ones we've already met because <laughs> love playing games you're bad at. Nah, that's fair. I like playing RTSs. I'm terrible at those, but so far I only know three servants that are in the game. Lanter is obviously Jean, is Jean d'Arc Alter. There's no disguising that. She looks exactly like Jean Alter. Uh, Berserker is Musashi. She outright tells us. And also, she was on all the fucking promotions. And I know there is an archer in here who has been in other series because I spoiled myself and watched a video of his noble phantasm. I won't specify who. Exactly! They're gaining magical energy through the ley line, which means... Cut off the flow and they'll disappear, right? It's possible. Let's give it a shot. The minor spirit font between Sudobashi and the monsters. Got it. Let's go. So... No. Oh shit, I get stuff for that. Holy crap. Does the servant start with G? No. It starts with an A. They disappeared. Nice work, Grandpa. Just as I thought. They were absorbing the spirit font's energy to maintain their form. Once their connection to the magical energy is severed, their power vanishes into thin air. If they lose their spirit font, they lose their power. Doesn't that mean the same thing could happen to us? Indeed. If we were to lose our tie to a minor spirit font, it would weaken us and our position. Taco told us as much. This is a war for territory. Right. We have to keep an eye on our enemy's moves. 
Ugh, fine, why do you want to go over here? I just stopped in, but this place has delicious food. When did you... You've got quite the appetite, Saber. As is the running tradition. Uh, speaking of which, because we've got new mountings. There we go. Oof, this one. Ooh. Increase the power of normal attacks. Increase affinity gauge fill rate. Ah, oh, those are really good. But it drops my attack down so much. Ah. Uh, this one has a better one with Earth, but I don't really use Earth all that much. Oh, here we go. These are much better. There we go. Break on through to the other side. Uh, what is this? Tidal Fury? Search your feelings. You know it to be true. Uh, can I do anything with... Uh... I guess I'll take this. I love when Twitch crashes. Oof. There we go. Alright. <sighs> Sudoboshi. and have a friend who starts with a K. Friend is a strong word, but yes. Sudoboshi. Wow, this place looked grim. And that's the samurai residence. Now to find Shoisetsu's student. Look at that throng of people over there. Is it a food stand? I wonder. Of all servants, I wonder why them? Good question. I guess we'll find out. I will say that is the big difference between this war. Um, since I don't, I don't know how much you know of it. Uh, but for those who didn't see the first uh, first part yesterday, the war is different. Uh, obviously, every master got a servant. There are seven servants. But total, there are 15 servants. There are eight rogue servants tied to certain areas. And I don't know what their gain is, but they're powered by, like, the ley lines themselves. And I guess they make allies with other people. There's a rogue berserker teamed up with uh, Musashi's master. And, of course, we saw uh, Arya as well. Oh, good. More dead. I'll fade in like two to three years. Fair enough. I will say, so far, this story isn't terrible. It's actually pretty decent. I mean, I don't know how much they're going to, how much that story is going to go up its own ass, like, by the time I finish the game. But so far, it's pretty all right, as far as fate stories are concerned. They have, like, an easy out for saying stuff. It's like, oh, this doesn't make sense. Like, why is this different than a normal war? And then we get a character say, well, the ritual is still working out some tweaks. It's like, okay, not perfected ritual. Makes sense. We have easily cleared up that confusion. Did something happen here? There was a fight here recently. We can't go through because of the investigation. Damn, I have business up ahead. That's unfortunate. Maybe you could come back again tomorrow. 
What should we do? Do we head back? This may be connected to the ritual. Let's look for another way to the residence. Yoink. Let's see. What have you got to say? I went into a guard and thought I was going to be cut down and then and there. I just staggered off somewhere. Serving at the castle must take it out of you. Oh. What's with this crowd? Did a fight break out? What is it? A brawl? I don't know what's going on. Did I not see the witch show up in a game where her lookalike fits just as well? I don't think so. I'm kind of curious to see who Caster is. From what I saw from, like, the opening, because the opening, of course, displayed all the master servants, I think. Uh, I didn't recognize most of them. I think they're all original characters. I mean, except for, obviously, Musashi and Lancer. Lancer is Jean d'Arc. Like, Jean Alter. There's no getting around that. <laughs> there's there's no hiding that. I will say, though, I did like that they chose, like, her first, like, her first ascension with the big cloak on. That looked way nicer than, say, like, her last ascension where she's not wearing as much clothes or the one where she just looks like Black Jean. Oh no, that's just okay. Whoa, hello. Oh, Altera is the witch. Oh. God, I hope not to. Uh, let's test out how this works, shall we? There we go. Not bad. Actual Jean Alter this time. I don't know. It definitely looks like her, but she's brandishing two spears and she creates black fire wherever she goes. We haven't seen her since the prologue, so I don't know what her and her master is up to. That's okay. Her master is making up for all of her lost edge. <laughs> like, he is some edgelord's dark fantasy, for sure. <laughs> There's a saber face to Noratoria, please. God. So he's still her edge then? I don't know. Like I said, she hasn't really done anything in the story yet. <laughs> so yours? Please. I have a little bit more class than that. Not much more, but a little bit. All right, hold on. Let me... Because I can do this. Where is it? Records. Prime... No. Logbook. Here we go. Biographies. Where is he? Here we go. Lancer's Master. Look at this picture. I won't say it, obviously, but you might be surprised in a good way. Of course, we have Saber. Lancer, I mean, like I said, it's obvious who she is. Rider, I don't know. Clad in giant armor and talks with a voice modifier. It's probably going to be revealed there's someone else that we know or some shit, which is going to piss me off. Musashi. Arya. The rogue berserker. Don't know who he is. Obviously, like most berserkers, he doesn't talk, which is surprising because it says Musashi is like completely berserk, but she talks perfectly fine. Come on, big guy. Is that a fucking laser beam?
I will say though, I do hate the having to break the barrier bit. That's probably my least favorite so far. Unless they don't, because I say so. Pretty much. There we go, finally. Yatta. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, be sure to leave it a like. And if you want to see more of my future content, be sure to hit the subscribe button. And to stay up to date with all of the releases that come out daily, be sure to click that bell. And if you're feeling a little bit generous, why not check out my Patreon page? Link is down in the description. And as always, until the next video, hasta.